Hi, boys and girls, and welcome to Being a Writer. Today, we are August 17, 2020, and it is our first lesson for being a writer. I'm so excited for today because today we will be exploring different things about what it, we will do in being a writer. So let's get started. Boys and girls, guess what? I have the best news. You are going to become part of a writing community. We will write in our community. We will write about things that are interesting, things that we want to share. We're going to talk about our writing with others. We're going to learn about professional authors and what they do. And most importantly, boys and girls, we're going to help one another become better writers. How awesome is that? So congratulations, boys and girls. You are officially a member in our writing community in Idea Quest Academy as second graders. Yay, happy class. So the first thing that we're going to talk about in our, in our writing community is what are some things you have written about? Think about it. Have you ever written about something? Boys and girls, you have. Last year, some of you were answering the focusing question tasks. You were writing about your favorite authors in your book reports or your favorite book. That is things that you have written about. You were even doing idea authors. So yes, you have done, you have done writing. On our writing community, we will do a lot of things where we're going to have lots of fun because not are we only going to be writing about topics, but we're going to be writing about things we want to write and things we like. And we're going to invent stories that are going to, oh my God, it's gonna be out of this world. I can't wait. Another, another question I want you to think about is, where do you see writing? Do you see writing at home? Do you see writing at school or in the neighborhood? I can say I see writing at home. My parents write grocery lists and those, that is writing. Those uh, grocery lists are written things. So, the author are my parents and they're writing a list. What? Yes. So that is part of the writing community. We're going to learn many different types of writing that maybe before we wouldn't think about. Writing time. Yes, boys and girls. So today we're going to have our first time for writing and it's gonna be very fun because I'm going to draw and write, and I know you all love to draw. So let's have some fun. So I'm gonna play this video, and it's of me drawing something. Pay very close attention. Mm, that looks like a house. Don't judge my drawing. I am not an artist, but I tried. I promise. So, Miss Alvarez, uh, that is just a house. Yes, it is just a house. But guess what, boys and girls? You can think of so many things by looking at this house. So let's think a little bit. What do you notice about this house? So I'm gonna go back and show you the end of the video so you can notice what do you notice about this house mm, it has windows it has a door and one of the windows has an x mm, that looks like it might be maybe broken maybe we'll see what story can you think about that will go with the picture with the drawing about the house with the broken glass thing. Maybe there was someone throwing rocks. Maybe there was someone playing with a ball. 
Maybe there was a hurricane and the window broke. Maybe um the window is designed like that. Maybe. Did you see how many ideas I got with just one picture? I had four different ideas. Yeah, that is how writing works. When you look at a picture, you can imagine many things that can go with it. And that is okay, boys and girls, because you guys are the authors. You are all the authors of your writing. So if some of you decide because there was a hurricane and others decide because there is a ball and others decide that that's the design of the, of the window, that is okay. You guys are free to write what you think that will go with the picture. That is perfectly okay. So you see, being a writer is very fun. So an example I had was Jesse and Amy were playing football on the lawn. Jesse threw a ball to Amy. The ball missed her and crashed through the window. Now they had to tell mom. So just with the picture, I came up with this story. Wow, and then we can continue. And mom got mad and said, you are grounded. And you are going to have to make all this sure so I can pay for that window. <gasps> Miss Alvarez, calm down. We're just writing a small piece. I know. Tomorrow, we will have more time to write about it more. So this is your assignment to do. It's your turn to draw and write. Miss Alvarez, I'm going to be able to draw? Yes. So get out your journal, get out your pencil, and let's get ready to draw and write. So you are going to be creative. Draw about something you want to draw about. It can be about you and a friend and write about it. Make sure to be creative, boys and girls. And when you are done, make sure you submit in your uh, Being a Writer team. So if you're in Mrs. Alice's homeroom, go to Being a Writer's homeroom, uh, not the homeroom class, but the Being a Writer team and submit your piece of writing with your picture. If you're in Mrs. Alvarez, go to Being a Writer and submit under assignments. I am so excited to see all of you become authors today and not even authors, not only, but illustrators. Yay! So go on. Take your time, draw a picture, write about the picture, and I'll see you tomorrow. Have a wonderful writing time, boys and girls. Love you all.